Hey my beautiful shining stars, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're having a wonderful day, not whatever it may be. Know that you're awesome and amazing and I am so glad you clicked on this video. If you are not a part of the beautiful shining star family, we would love to have you. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button and click that notification bell. Today I am super excited because ColourPop done it once again, you guys. They collabed with Disney and they came out with their Disney Villains Collection. And I am so stoked about this, you guys. Like, I was really excited when they did the Disney Princess collaboration and I came up with that sweet Prego Ariel look. Um, but the villains, there's just something about them because like with the princesses inside of the cartoons, when you're asked to do like a Disney princess makeup, they're usually like very natural. And I love natural, but I get more stoked about the villains because they are done up. You know what I'm saying? I mean, Ursula full on glam, okay? Um, but anyways, I'm super stoked to dive into this and I'm gonna do some swatches. This is the makeup look that I came up with using the palette. Um, but yeah, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> so this is the package. Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> Brand spanking and new, you guys. Look at that box. It is amazing. Holographic goodness. Starting off with the actual eyeshadow palette. It is so gorgeous, you guys. It's called Misunderstood, and it's in that neon font, and anybody who knows me knows that I'm obsessed with the neon. And then also the holographic, it says Disney Villains. And it actually has the Disney Villains within the artwork, and I love it. You turn it over, and you have all the different names of the shadow, and now we're going to open it. So on the inside, they have it all that matte black and it's almost like it's embossed with um, the drawings of the different art that goes with the different villains, like the seashell for Ursula. Very, very, very cool. And here are the shadows that we will be watching. So this first one is a white, matte shadow and it's called No Spots, tributing to Cruella de Vil. Cruella. It's a little bit like fallout going on there, but it's a nice soft powder that's nice and white. The second one is Mongrels. <laughs> this one is uh, like a shimmery champagne, a light champagne color. And I'm noticing with these there is a bit of fallout with each one, but once it's on there, it's really nice. And that one has a pretty shine to it. The next one in this row is this gorgeous green, which I used for my eyes um, in the look that I came up with. And it is a beautiful like lime green that has a shimmer to it. And that one's Diablo. Diablo! This next one is Devious, and it is a rich, kind of like a tan bark brown. I think that's a good like blending um, color to put in the, the crease area. It's very nice. And the last one on this row is also a matte. It's kind of like a beige and ooh, you can barely see it on my skin. But this one is a good transition color, I think as well. And this one's tragic. All right, starting off with the second row. And this one is Underworld. Whoa, which this is a very pretty coppery shimmer. Oh, very pretty. Yum. The next one is Pain and Panic. This is also uh, from the movie Hercules. Hercules, Hercules. And Pain and Panic actually like have chunkier gold specks in it. Very nice. The next one is a very vibrant purple, which is so gorgeous. Forest of Thorns which I'm guessing is for Maleficent. You guys seen the preview for Maleficent 2? Oh my goodness. 
Angelina Jolie is so gorgeous and I heard Michelle Pfeiffer is going to be in it. Ooh! So yes, that is a very beautiful, vibrant, shimmery purple. Mm -hmm. This next shimmer is Flopsum, one of those nasty eels of Ursula's. This is more of a warm champagne color. It kind of has a little bit like a pinkish purple hue to it. And the last one on this row is The Fates and it is a deep blue. Oh yeah, that one is very pretty. And there is that row. And the first one in the third row across is Revenge and it is a beautiful black. And the black has little specks of like silver shimmer in it. Very nice. And then we have Sing. Oh, this one's very pretty. It's almost like a purplish, reddish brown shimmer. Now Sing. This is like a rusty, shimmery purple. It's hard to describe the color, but it's really pretty. This next one's Jetsam, the other nasty eel of Ursula's. And this one is like a darker, color but it has like the shift of shimmer is a blue and it's almost like for these two the underneath or all of these are like black but then on the top it has like a purplish shimmer and this one is like the blue shift to it very pretty the next one in this row is like in the theme of the others where it's like a darker shadow this one has a green shimmery shift to it gorgeous and last but not least, we have 101, which is like a grayish black shadow that's a matte. Bam, sham -a lamb And that wraps up the eyeshadow palette. So next up, we have the Jelly Much shadows of the collection. And this is kind of new to me. I really like these. They're high pigmentation and they don't crease, fade, or transfer. All right, so we're just gonna pop this open. Slide it. So I like this because it's like goopy, goopy goop. Get some on my finger and do a swatch for you. And this one is a jade green shadow and it has uh, multi glitter specks in it. Glitter shimmer, glitter sparkle. This next one is Ursula's Just Your Voice. And this one is blue and this one is an electric blue with a purple dew chrome flip so you could definitely see like there's more sparkle specks in this one and this one's more like shimmery and chromey chromey domey this next one is Cruella's perfectly wretched Ooh, yeah. and this one is a pink icy taupe with a multicolor glitter this next one is Maleficence, and this is Spindle. And this one is a cool tone lavender with a champagne gold flip. This one is the Evil Queen's Jelly, and it is called Curse. It is such a pretty gold. So this one, I think is my favorite so far, and this is like an antique gold. And last but not least, we have Hades, I Own You. And this one is a corally red with an orange dew chrome flip. So these Jelly Mutt shadows, I really like them. I think they're super fun and unique. Next up, we have the Disney Villains Ultra Glossy Lip Gloss. Their lip gloss is popping. And the first one I'm start starting off with is Shadow Man. This one is a duo chrome crimson with a golden green flip. Mmm, it smells so good. This next one is the Evil Queen's Bad Apple. So this one is a cranberry color with a glass-like shine and a little hint of shimmer. Shimmer, shimmer. This next one is Maleficent, my pet. And this one is a cool tone icy lavender with a hot pink dual chrome flip. And this one's Ursula's Sad But True. And this one's ultra like sheer. So this one is an opalescent blue and it has like a really high shine to it with a little bit of shimmer. Then we have Hades Hot Headed. Whoa, this one's more of a metallic. 
And this one is a dual chrome bronzy orange with a hot pink flip. Ooh. And last but not least, we got Cruella DeVille's Poppies. I like Poppies. This one is a translucent gloss with flecks of gold glitter. All right, you guys, next we have their lipsticks and they have four cream and two matte. So first off, I have Maleficent, which is a cream lipstick. So watch it. It's cool because on the lipstick itself, it, it says villains. So again, this is a cream lipstick and it is a rich magenta color for Maleficent. The next cream lipstick I have is Dr. Facilier. Facilier, Facilier. And this one is a mid-tone warm berry lipstick. Then we have Hades. Ooh, this is beautiful. This is the one that I have on right now. And this one is a neutral peachy nude. Next up we have Cruella. Wow, and this is a vibrant pop and red. This one is also a cream lipstick. Next up, we have Evil Queen, and this one is a matte. Whoa. Oh, she is beautiful. <gasps> I love this color. So this one is a rich cherry red. Last but not least, we have Ursula. Ursula. And this one also is a matte. This one is blackened plum. So that is all for the lipsticks, and my favorite is definitely Evil Queen and Hades. All right, you guys, next up we have the highlighters, which I love the packaging for these. Again, it's the neon um, on the outside of the actual palettes. Around it is holographic, and in the middle is the highlighter. So this one, starting off, is uh, from Cruella de Vil, and this one is called You Idiots, You Fools, You Imbeciles! Boom Shakalakers. So this is a pale peach with a coppery flip and flecks of silver. Next up is Ursula in Poor Unfortunate Soul. Ooh, this one's nice and purpley. And this one is an opalescent lavender. Then we have Maleficent. And this one is an icy champagne. Next up we got Hades looking all cray cray. <laughs> and this one's Everybody's Got a Weakness. Ooh, this is like, they're super soft and almost like, it feels creamy. Creme. Can you see it? Next, we have Dr. Facilier on the other side. You got friends on the other side. This one's a golden peach with a pearlized finish. And last but not least, we have the Evil Queen in Fairest of Them All. This one is a champagne gold with a pearlized finish. The consistency is like it says, it's buttery soft powders that feel creamy, apply super smoothly, and blend evenly into the skin. And of course I saved the best for last, which you guys know I'm a sucker for glitter. And this is their Glitterly Obsessed Face and Body Glitter. So this first one is, do I look like I care? Pop that open. Look at it, it's beautiful. Bam. This is a pink gel paste with different glitters that reflect different colors and different sizes. And this next one is Anomaly. Oh yeah. Yeah, so this one's like a pinkish purple and this one's a greenish blue. So that is it for my ColourPop Disney Villains collaboration review. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it. Please let me know in the comment section below what Disney villain you would like to see me create, even if I've already done it before, and the one that gets the highest I wanna do. And remember, you are beautiful, baby, so shine like a star. Mwah. <laughs>